When I first moved to San Antonio, I served on the High Council uh, under A. Ray Audi, who was the stake president of the San Antonio, Texas stake. And I recall during that period that it was made known to us as a High Council that a sister, Addie Smith, had died and donated her entire $20,000 insurance policy for a future temple to be built in the San Antonio area. To my knowledge and recollection, that was the first time I'd ever uh, heard the t a temple possibly being constructed in San Antonio, but I was impressed at the time. Nothing further was said other than that those funds would be set aside in a special trust fund for some future date for that to occur. My first recollection of Agony is in old Wendy Vista Chapel. She was a very faithful person. She was not married. She was an old maid, so to speak, and, and she just looked after her mother and and took care of her there. And she, anything and everything that we needed done, she was willing to do. And, and she was just a, a, a really a nice, nice lady. I remember Addie because she was my Sunday school teacher. And I still have a, a Bible that she gave me because I uh, learned some, so many scriptures and all. And I think it's dated April of 1952. When she, uh, when it got pretty close to where she knew she was going to die, well, she says, well, I'm going to give you my, my, uh, my death uh, money, in other words, insurance for life insurance, and I'm going to give you that. I want you to take that and, and not use it until we get a temple, and we'll use this for our temple. She had the faith, and she uh, really knew within herself that uh, there was going to be a temple in San Antonio and so forth. She, so she uh, gave that to the church, and we sent it into Salt Lake and under, under the San Antonio Temple Fund. And uh, they kept it there at, at church headquarters, and it drew interest for all the time until the, it was ready to be used. And consequently, she made a, a great... Uh, contribution to the to the San Antonio Temple. 